Oh. Right, well that was the most enjoyable 10 holes. Um, I haven't had a chance to do any filming on the course just because I hooked up with a member um, and we're sort of working on these chipping and these bits and pieces as always turns into a lesson but hey ho all good fun um, but it has given me a chance to try out this new hole 19 app um, and uh, it's a GPS system where it gives you yardages or basic aerial view yardages into holes uh, different shots in my face but it's also quite a good place to track your stats um, and it's quite a social place to hang out with other players and see how other people have got on various courses. So I'll put all my links in the description below. Um, so come along and join me over there. But I think it'll be quite a good fun place to hang out, track my stats um, and see if it helps me improve. Right, so that's Monday wrapped up. Just had a couple of beginners, first timers to golf to finish up this evening. It's always great fun to give people their first introduction into this wonderful game. So now to get home, get some tea, uh, and hope England win the football. <laughs> Very important job today. Gonna measure the junior tees on our nine hole course. So all my little junior tiddlers know how far the holes are. Side. written up my blue T scorecard for the juniors giving the holes a little bit of a name as well to make it a bit more fun so hopefully they can get out and start using that but to be honest it'd be quite good for some of the better players and more experienced players just to play from those tees try out a bit more of their short game right then one legged driver challenge let's go Playing lesson in the sun. Is there anything nicer? Yeah, look at that. <laughs> Righty ho, so Thursday afternoon, just prepping for our big County Upper School Golf Day tomorrow. Just a small matter of um, 21 sets of hire clubs to sort out for them all to use. Um, and if you wondered what 21 sets of hire clubs looks like, it would be roughly hmm, about that, plus the three that I'm carrying. from Footjoy. First of all this lovely shirt that I'll be sporting today um, for our coaching day. But I've also been sent a pair of these freestyles. Now when you're a coach it's very important that you have very comfy golf shoes, very comfortable shoes that you can wear all day long. And these look like they're gonna do the job. So we shall find out.
first impressions are good. Plenty of space in them for me big feet. Yeah, nice and comfy. We'll wander around, do we? They're gonna be good. Well, it's Saturday evening, the end of a really busy week that I've had. Lots going on. I'm just sat here watching some of the WGC. Gonna Get a little bit of inside scoop so I can see who I'm going to predict in the Basement Golf Show tomorrow. Make sure you tune into that uh, on our other, other channel, PGA Life 365. All the links are down below. Um, we're going to have all your usual favourites, so Lynx Master, Big Whack, Tall V Small. Um, and all I've got left to look forward to is small matter of the Gosfield Triathlon, which is tomorrow morning. So I'm down here in the studio, I'm going to prep all my gear, make sure that I've got everything ready, present and correct for the morning. Um, so tune into my vlog next week uh, and we'll see how we get on. We'll also be able to find out who won Berry Club Championships um, and we've got a little surprise next week. Um, so stay tuned and look out for that. As always, thank you very much for watching the video. Please subscribe to the channel, please click the like button if you do enjoy this um, and share it around. I'm sure there are other people out there that would like to have a small insight into my very exciting life that I lead. Um, so thanks again, and see you next week.